You're watching On Air Podcast right here. Make sure that you subscribe to our YouTube channel. As you kept on moving forward, uh, uh, everything came together, let's see. It, yeah. it, it kept on coming together as you move forward. What I'm trying to track back is, who did you have to convince at that age, you know? Did you have to convince your parents that I'm going to stay here? <laughs> you know, obviously, I'm sure that was like a big big part of your life, you know, like going back to Jersey, living a life there, your friends, I'm sure high school friends were there, mom and dad, extended family. How did you convince them that you're going to stay? God knows, a blip in the planet. Yeah. Like, how, how did you convince them? It was such a challenging time because I had kept pitching like, oh, I'm just going to stay a little longer. I'm going to stay. And then I'll go back to college mm-hmm. and I'll go get my degree. You know, my mom really, basically, my parents were a little... Um, counter culture like they weren't like those parents that were like you have to do this and checking my report card but they still had expectations so I'd go to college yeah and so that was a big thing and then just my basic safety right like my basic safety and security would I be okay so my mom has this line that I think perfectly sums it up she's like when I won we won CNN heroes our name was on billboards and she was like see Now everybody's telling me what an amazing parent I was and how did you raise such a daughter. But if anything had happened to you, anything, you know, trekking through Calico, anything had gone wrong, I Mm. would have been called like the worst mother in the world. Exactly. Flip (laughs) side, the other side. I was sending a 19-year-old traveling through the the back country of India into Nepal. And I think back at that time, and I was like, Mm. that was pretty ballsy. Yeah. Like, that was pretty, I think back and I'm like, would I let my kid do that now? I don't exactly. know. Exactly. That, that, you're, you're getting what I'm trying to say, where I'm coming into, like, you know, n- like now, the kids, again, coming back to the uh, conversation about the kids, your kids now, you know, like, uh, not just your two kids, like, all, all the kids that you have, you know, like, now, would you, would you tell them to take that, that risk? So back to what you and I were yeah, saying, yeah, yeah. we have to step off of these expectations, the magic in life, the beauty, everything about my story happened the second I stepped out of the bubble. So we have to say yes, and we can't live in fear, and we have to do the hard thing. You know, there was no reason why I should have been successful, why this organization has grown and flourished. We had nothing. We had nothing. You know, like, but it's almost like because we had nothing, that's what made us what we are today. तपाईले हाम्रो क्लिप एकदमै एन्जॉय गर्नुभयो होला अब पुरै भिडियो हेर्नको लागि चाहिँ युट्युब मा सब्स्क्राइब गर्न नबिर्सिनु होला दिस प्रोग्राम इज ब्रट टु यु बाइ व्यास स्टुडियोज